Hello, everybody. We are back with another week of Fantasy DB Scoop. I'm Dom. And this is Brody. Episode 2, baby. Episode 2. You guys ready? Let's start it off. Every week, we're going to start with power rankings. Power Brody, 12 to 1. Let's 12 go. 12 to 1. All right. Who had a tough week this week? Will Milley. Wow, I have never seen a worse performance <laughs> in my whole life in fantasy football. Not a good debut not for a Will. Great, not, not a great not debut. Not a league debut. Terrible. Not just a season debut. I mean, league. how many points did he put up? 64. 64. I mean, hey, you got 12. How many players is it? 12? 12, 12, yeah, I think so. 1, 2, 3, 4, what, 10 5, maybe? 6, 7, 8, 9. 9, nine, nine players. You got nine 64 players. 64 points. 9 players played this week and you dropped 64. I mean, not Not know. the performance you're looking for. I no, mean, did he all. have one player over two? Yeah, he had two players over 10 points. I, I mean, mean, that is just... It's really hard for us to to put him anywhere but 12 right. after I mean, that. You I can't. Mean, we, we had him at 5. We had him at 5. Week. But, I mean, That's crazy. You, you, you can't be higher than 12. You, you don't even break 65 points. No. Like, that's just... Mm-mm. Uh, there's not we don't, we don't even for. need another explanation for that. Like no, we'll just leave it at sixty four point four points. That's terrible, man. Alex coming in at number eleven, the reigning champ again. We're gonna say it again. We said it last week. He is the reigning champ. He did so. He did win this week, but this had to have been one of the worst fantasy football weeks ever. Like, I think yeah, more I than mean, half of our league didn't even break hundred points. Yeah, I mean, this, like this week was just terrible, man. It was A lot like, of people played like it was that bad. Crap. Like he did win. But his team just, I mean, he didn't show up. I mean, 119 points, it's not a bad week. But then was again. Was he the high score? I think he, was, I think I think he, he got a high score this week. I actually. think he was. Which, But now he just, he, the injury bug already had him. Ooh. He lost Jacoby Myers now. Yeah, Jacoby and Myers, for at least concussion this week, protocol. At least this week. He had 30 points this week. He doesn't have him this week. So, I mean, now, who does he even have to replace him? I don't know. So, I can't, we can't yet. If he has, another, if he has a good week this week, I'm sure he'll move up. But oh, yeah. now that he lost Jacoby Myers, too, I mean, I, I we can't put him higher than 11. Can't, you just can't. You can't. And, I mean, coming in at 10, you got Ryan. You know, he had a solid week, I guess. How moved, many points? Moved up another spot. 105. He got 10 up, now. Went up a spot. I mean. He had 105. I mean. Had a, uh, uh, I mean, for I get, a bad week of fantasy, for, he had a For this week. fantasy week, 105 isn't that bad. I mean, but then again, you got to put him at 10 because if Tyree Kill doesn't have a career right. game, right. he gets blown out. Like, I mean, I mean 45 right. points. I mean, starting the season off, 45 points, if, I mean, that's If Tyreek just mean. hits his projection at, I think it was 20, he loses by 15 points. Right. So, I mean, if he doesn't have a career game, I mean, that's just it. Like, so, I mean, and then he had, he had uh, Bijan who had 22. Like, but it's Bijan and Tyreek. The rest of his team did nothing. So, I mean, you right. can't put him higher than 10 right now. Uh, at number nine. Next? Nine me. I stay the same. I mean, Wow. I had a rough week, man. Aaron Rodgers. 97 torn a, points. Torn Achilles, right? Oh, yeah, Aaron Rodgers. That's right. You and know, all I needed him to do, all I needed was nine points, man. Nine yeah. points, first four plays. Done. Done. Season. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? We did, I did take an L this week. <laughs> and Kadarius, Kadarius Tony also, uh, I, mean, I know Logan made you aware of his performance oh, yeah. this week. Oh, yeah, he sure did. And, and David, too. I'm, Just I, and David. We know how the, the group chat exploded after that one. Brody's one point. On opening night of fantasy, oh, yeah. from Kadarius Tony, but we're we're gonna go past that because he he's had enough I mean, of that this week. He's had I mean, enough yeah. of that. <laughs> Coming in at number eight is me. I did fall two spots. I threw up ninety points this week. Not a good performance. I mean, again, bad fantasy week. So hopefully I bounce back this week. But I mean, Drake London zero points. Thank you. Appreciate that showing up to play. I mean, Brandon Ayuk had a great game. Brandon Ayuk thirty four points. Great though. game. Or thirty three points. I'll take that all day. But I mean, nobody else really, nobody else really showed up for me. I mean, neither of my running backs even broke ten points. Justin Fields only had fourteen. But we're we're bouncing back. We're bouncing back right, this right. week. We bouncing all are. Back. We right. All are. Absolutely. Uh, at Who seven, next? at seven, you know, we had our twelve from last week jump all the way up to seven. Jumped five up. spots for the Joey Sheedy. Jumped up five spots, and I mean, I gotta give it to him, man. His team was in rough shape before it this was. week. His team was in real rough shape, man. He had a lot of injuries going into this week, and hey, he pulled it together. And Put up one oh six. Put up one oh six. Pulled it together. Got the win over me this week. Which in this hey. week, one oh six wasn't bad. So yeah. that was respectable. Right. Travis Etienne had a good week, twenty points. Yep. But um, yep. So we're, we're just gonna leave it there. We'll leave it at that. Uh, coming in at number five. No, no sorry, six. number six. There we have go. Logan, which 84 points this week. Again, bad performance, but bad fantasy week. His team is really good. He's got Joe Burrow, Josh Jacobs, Jamar Chase. They all had off weeks, but that's not going to happen again. Like, that was a I fluke. Mean, that's, three, that's three top fantasy players that just 
It was a bad fantasy week. Joe Burrow had a terrible week, and we all know he's better than that. Joe Shiesty, we all know he does right. better than that. So. Logan, so he did fall three spots, but, I mean, his team's good. He has another week. I'm sure he'll be back up there again right. as long as they do produce. Uh, number five, we got ben. ben. We got Ben. He fell one spot. Fell one spot. Did he win this week? He didn't. He lost to Ryan. He did lose. So he actually, he was matchup. coming into Sunday, projected like 93 points. Like yeah. he, he, he was. He had a low projection. It was rough, but he had a couple players step up. Mike right. Evans, 18 points. I mean, Justin Herbert had a decent game, but Thursday night kind of killed him. Uh, yeah, I mean, a little disappointing with Jameer Gibbs right there. Sky Moore, too. Sky Moore. Jameer Gibbs is a beast, by the way. He's gonna he's gonna be a beast. That was a yeah. They, I don't know why they didn't give him the ball more. He was just because uh, they kept ball. throwing it to Kadarius <coughs> Tony, who dropped every single pass that touched <laughs> his hands. But True. I guess it happens. Yeah, Ben will be up there. We got David at number four. He fell two spots. Where is he? He had ninety four points. Lost to lost to Nolan. I mean, not what you expected. Uh, T Higgins zero points. I don't zero. Know how I, that happened? No, me neither. Saquon only had nine because we all saw what happened on Sunday Night Football in that massacre of the Giants. That was brutal. That was not right. Christian Kirk one point nine. He just had a lot of players just not perform. Yeah, I mean on paper his team's great. Right. I mean, but yeah, so he should be doing great. I but think hey, honestly, off week this week, week two in that and beyond, we're gonna see what teams are really good. I feel like week one should kind of be scratched because right. of, well, I don't know what there was just no offense this week. All right, All right, top three. Top we, three, we, we got, got Luke, Luke up two spots, put up a pretty decent week for a bad fantasy week, 113. He beat uh, Logan here. Uh, I mean, yeah, his team did good. I mean, Austin Eckler had a great week, 34 points out of one guy. That's Only really 12 out of Hurts, though, yeah. and Alave, 19, that was good, but T- Debo only 11. I mean, there's definitely a lot of people that will be a lot better in coming weeks for him, yeah. for sure. Oh, yeah. All right, number two, we had, Cam. I believe, our biggest jump of the week. Yep, it was. Coming in at number two, we have Cam Monahan. Where yep. is he at? Where is he at? Cam Monahan. Here he is. 115 points this week. And, again, that's with Lamar getting six points and and uh, George Kittle getting four. Yeah. Like, he just has a lot of players, again, that won't pr- like that will produce in coming weeks. Zay Flowers. Big p- big pickup for him. Great pickup. Seventeen man. points from him. He's going to be a beast this year for sure. I mean, Calvin just, Ridley. I said wow. it last week, and I was right. He is a dog. He will be a dog. Twenty five points in his debut. Hasn't played a game in two Hats years. Hats off to Calvin Ridley, man. He's going to go crazy this he's gonna year. He's going to be a top five receiver this year, no doubt. No doubt at all. All right, number one. Remaining at number one. Remaining at number one. Is Nolan. Lumley. Nolan. Yeah, yeah. I mean, one twelve in an off week. Off I mean, week, just he solid. Did good. Mahomes got twenty. Najee got five. He's gonna have to make. He might have to make a move there, but we'll see. I mean, but honestly, just like I don't even. There's not much to say. He just had it. He just had, had a DeAndre Swift do? Week. DeAndre Swift not Terrible. good. He started DeAndre Swift that is uh, on his ben, on his flex one point. Not but, good. So there's good. your power rankings for week two, uh, mm-hmm. and so we had. We're gonna do a little thing. A little biggest jump, biggest fall. So our biggest jump was Cam at up, six. Up six. Up and six. Then he was at eight. Jumped to two. Biggest it, fall was Will, minus seven spots. I mean. Went from five to dead last. Tough. It is just tough. All right, we'll run through our starts and sits real quick. Brody, you want right. to start it off? Yep, my start this week, Allen Robinson. And you know what? I think he can be good. You know, I think he's going to get more target shares here. Um, Deontay Johnson just went down, might be out for a few weeks here. So I think he's going to like really that. do good here. Hopefully Kenny, uh, what's his name? Kenny Pickett. Kenny Pickett. Yeah. Kenny Pickett. Hopefully he gets him the ball good, and you know they have some good games coming up this week. And uh, I'm gonna sit Michael Thomas. I mean, he had a few receptions last week, but I feel like he's really not picking up the yards, not picking up the stuff. And you know what? I feel like Chris Olave is really taking over that offense. So I agree. I like that pick. My start instead of the week, I got, I'm starting JSN Jackson Smith and Jigba. He didn't have a great debut. He only had I think like four points, but this is the week, I'm telling you. He's going against, uh, I think they play Detroit this week. I'm yeah, they pre- do. They play Detroit, and we all know Detroit does not have a good secondary. They, they're they known to let up big games from receivers. So I think JSN, I mean, that receiver room is so open that Detroit just doesn't have the depth to cover three receivers. Right. JSN, DK, and Lockett, yeah. they're going to be open. They got a great they're gonna, receiver. They're going to cover DK before they cover him. Lockett's a good inside guy. I mean, JSN, he, this, is, this is the week he's going to break out. I'm seeing 15 points from him. Yeah, and then I like I, that. I'm sitting Najee because, I mean, I know that the, the Steelers only had one total yard the first half of the game, and it wasn't, it wasn't all on Najee, but, I mean, I just 
I need to see something out of him. Like, I was I was kind of hopeful he'd be okay coming in this week, but, I mean, he just had a pity performance. I know he's a strong runner, but I just need to see more out of that Pittsburgh offense and offensive line before yeah. he's a lock start again. Yeah, I agree with that 100%. That's a good, that's a good and, Anything else you want to add in there, Brody? Um, um, let's see. Uh, oh, it's just from last week. Oh, yeah, last, last, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's go over ours from last week. From last week. I had Dalvin. My sit of the week was Dalvin Cook. And I think I was pretty on point with that. I think he had nine points. Brees Hall had like 130 rushing yards. So what I said about that, we don't know who's going to be the bigger runner, whose offense is it going to be. I think I was right to say that we don't know still. So I like that. Say I think that was right. And my start was Andrew Madison. I think he had 13.4, which is solid. I mean, it's not anything crazy, but as like RB2 borderline flex, I think that's a great start. I, so I, I like that one. I mean, I, you know what? I kind of had a rough week this week with my sits and start. I mean, I had no idea. Christian Watson didn't even end up playing. So but he I got mean, zero points, right? I mean, that's I guess so. I thought, I really that's, thought great, he, that's a great sit. Though. I really thought he was going to play, man, but I guess he didn't. I guess he was hurt somehow. But Scratch that, then. Scratch that. Bad sit, but it's whatever. My start was Johan Dotson, and I mean, you know what? He started off strong, but he just ended up There wasn't much average. offense from Washington either. Not much. Tarnie yeah, McClellan they, didn't do well either. Back and forth game, really. So they didn't really do much, so that's tough, but hey. Hey, it is what it is. It is what it is, man. All right. I think that'll <laughs> wrap it up today now. Yep. All right. That was a good. Thanks for good. joining us. Thank Episode two, season two. Season two. And we'll see Stay you tuned. next Wednesday. See you next week.